Welcome everyone to a very spooky daily kick. Uh, yeah, that's it. That's all I got. Hey, once again, there's a new TF2 update. This update, uh, it was doing stuff about Halloween, so you can play like the old Halloween game modes, like from 2013 and 2012 and 11. And spooky. And uh. Also, CSGO, which really fucking surprised me, CSGO, you can, uh, there's a Halloween update now. Yeah, there's like, zombie chickens, and everyone's wearing like, Payday 2 or TF2 masks. It's really spooky. 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 Sp <laughs> oh, uh, GTA 5. It said it's supposed to be run at 1080p. 60 frames a second of the PS4. Oh my fucking god! Speaking of GTA, San Andreas is also coming to the 360 every remastered version. Oh boy, I love that game. It. I hope it. It's really remastered and not just like bad. <laughs> Do you ever playing Super Smash Brothers Melee on a GameCube? Yeah, that game was fun, right? Remember Mewtwo? He was cool. He was cool. Was, I don't know. Was he in Brawl? No. Yes. Was he in Brawl? No? Yes? Mewtwo was not in Brawl! Confirmed by Ben. You heard it here, folks. And Mewtwo is now going to be in the new Super Smash Brothers. But here's the catch. He'll be DLC for people who purchase both Wii U and 3DS versions of Super Smash Brothers, which costs, like, $100. Cumulatively. Just to play as Mewtwo. He's probably going to suck dick, too, so why the fuck would you... Okay. okay, for the, like, 10 people who still play Titanfall, there's a new major update coming soon. This major update, well the biggest thing that's coming to this major update is Frontier Defense. And that's like a new cooperative game mode. Who knows what it's going to be about. But guess what? It, it, I, I haven't played that game in a long time. I probably should. Bye. Hey, are you PS4 people still playing PS4? Yeah, I bet you are because it's a really good system. That wasn't sarcasm at all. There's going to be a new update uh, coming up. Uh, this next Tuesday, but by the time you're watching this, it probably would have already happened. So, the update's gonna include USB music players, changing colors, I don't know what that means, enhancement to live broadcasting, friend finder, content area and library, enhanced voice commands, add to library. I, you guys probably know this more than I do, so get ready for it. And if you're ready, it already happened. I hope you're ready for it. So the Assassin's Creed Unity minimum requirements have been leaked. I, I linked, I guess. So the uh, minimum OS uh, is Windows 7. Yeah. Windows 8 or 8.1. Uh, Vista. Sorry, sorry, no Vista or XP. That's probably to be expected. Um, CPU minimum until Core i5 2500K at 3.3 gigahertz or AMD FX 8. 50 at 4.0 gigahertz or above RAM 6 above 6 or above uh, GPU NVIDIA GeForce GTX 680 you need a 680 boy uh, sound card DX9 HDD fucking hard drive above 50 gigs oh my god and above 256 kilobytes per second upload bandwidth or higher I hope you enjoyed this spooky episode of Daily Kick Issue Edition, whatever the hell you want to call it. Keep on kicking. Outro.